Well, Sangaman operates across three main sectors in the UK. We operate in the distribution sector. We have brands like Juice and Graham in there. We operate in the construction product sector where we manufacture products, allied products like British Gypsum, Weber, Hesa, etc. But also in the high performance materials. Uh, we currently employ about 16,000 people and we turn over around about £3.5 billion. And we decided as Sangaban to launch the Entrepreneurship Foundation in the UK uh, on the back of really the 350th anniversary of the group Sangaban, but also main, two main reasons really. Firstly, to address the skills shortage, which has come on the back of, of, of five tough years of recession from 2008. And as we all know within the construction industry, a lot of people went out of this construction industry. So to so address our future clients, and secondly, in terms of a celebration of, of the 350 year, really. So, so supporting industry, supporting small industries, which I think is very important. Those are the reasons why we, we launched the foundation. The Sangamon Entrepreneurship Foundation aims to support small businesses in construction grow. So it does that by providing a range of practical skills, but also the important business skills that you need to, if you're running a small business to grow. So what is marketing, what is strategy, what is finance, how do you quote for a, a job? So it's going to provide a, a mix of both practical and business skills. Another part of the foundation is linking it to mentors in our business who um, you know, are responsible for, for marketing or business development within one of our businesses and having a mentor role um, to help them as they learn through the 12-month programme. So its aim you know, principally is to help those small businesses accelerate their growth, employ more people over the years ahead. I heard about the foundation through Minsters, um, that's where I buy more material from. I um, was in there one afternoon collecting some material and it was suggested that uh, maybe I would uh, be interested in it. So just said yeah, put me forwards, um, had a telephone conversation with somebody and obviously the, the mental side of it appeals to me because I can get some guidance to go on and probably aspire and do what I actually want to do, which is to be the biggest render applicator in East Anglia. So, yeah, hopefully we can get there together. We got a communication that went to the company director. He put it in front of me and said, is this going to help us move forward? And straight away I said yes. So we went for it. We heard about the foundation through initially through the CITB. Um, and we thought that was a good next step for us after going through the Growth Accelerator program. We are hoping to get out of the course a raised profile. We want to be a bigger business and we see the foundation as a very good partner to help us to get to where we want to get. Uh, well, we, I heard about it, it come from an email um, from CITB because we're involved with them for the apprenticeships and things like that. Um, and it, it came through, um, it was a, you know, an entrepreneurship foundation course. I'm quite keen on, on, you know, growing my company and looking down other avenues as well, like the secondary company, Brick Tiles Nationwide. Um, so when it came up and I noticed that I fitted, you know, we fit the criteria, um, I just thought it couldn't be a bad thing. Um, you know, offering professional mentors in different areas of, of business, like sales and marketing health and safety and different things like that. Um, obviously the professionals, the mentors, um, I, well, me and my business partner set our company up from nothing and not knowing anything. Um, so if I can, you know, get, a, you know, gain a few skills and techniques and ideas and ways of doing things from the foundation course, it can only be a good thing for myself. So I was pretty pleased when I got selected knowing that there was only a few places going. I think that there's going to be a number of benefits that will exist within the networking of, of the foundation because there are a number of other companies that on a day-to-day -day basis we wouldn't have rubbed shoulders with or, or, or spoken with in a, form, uh, in a forum like this in any way, shape or form. And so what it does is it gives us the ability to speak together, to understand one another and then share ideas one with another and who knows what will happen as a result of that, but I think that the prospect of that is exciting.